In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to refund items on Roblox. And this is going to apply to any item, UGC, whatever you need. So firstly, you're just going to want to go to roblox.com on your web browser. So as you can see, I am on Chrome right now. But once you're there, you're going to want to click on the Roblox, uh, Robux button on the top right of the screen and then click on my transactions. So as you guys can see, as of right now on this account, I don't have any like transactions or any past things I bought, but it's going to work the exact same um, either way. So basically, yeah, once you're here, you're going to want to go on the settings cog on the top right. And then where it says um, help and help and safety, just click on that real quick. Now, once it loads, you're going to want to click on the help center where it says quick answers to common questions. Just click on that real quick. Yeah. So now once you're on this part, you're going to want to click on payments, gift cards and subscriptions. Now, once you're on this page, you're going to want to scroll down until you see subscription and there's going to be a thing that says subscription billings and refunds. Just click on that real quick. Yeah. So now once you're on this, it's going to say subscription billing and refunds at the top. You're going to want to scroll all the way down until you see need more help contact support here. So just click that. Now you're going to want to just make sure you're on the right account. So as you can see, I am on my burnout God account. So make sure you're on the right account. It's going to ask you for your username and you're just going to want to put in your Roblox username. It's going to say your first name and email address. So just put the first name that you did put on your Roblox account itself. And for the email address, this is very important. Make sure you put the email address that is actually associated with the Roblox account you're trying to refund with. So don't use some random email. Don't use the email from your mom. Use the email that actually you put on the account that you're actually trying to get a refund from. And then from here where it says confirm email address, just re-put the email address. Now here for the issue details, this is the important part as well. You're going to want to make sure that you just put your device type. So just, just be honest with this one. So for me, I'm on PC and then the type of category help, you're going to want to put billing and payments. Yeah. So for your um, type of category help, you're going to want to click on billings and payments. And for help subcategory type, you're going to want to say, I want to report an unauthorized charge or request a fund. So here's where it gets really important. So yeah, you're just going to want to copy and paste what I just put in, but change it based on your scenario. So you're going to want to say, hi, Roblox team. My younger brother was accidentally bought the item. Now list the item right here. So if you bought like um, a shirt, say, Say the shirt name and say now say the price right here say the price of the robux right here which i did not want to purchase so basically what you're going to want to say is oh it wasn't me it was my little brother which i didn't realize so this way the robux the staff is going to be able to actually get you the refund say kindly take the item back and provide me a full refund i'll be waiting for your favorable response and if you want with the extra cherry on top you can say like thanks and then just put the name that you did put up here as your first name but yeah that's how you're going to be able to get like an 80 percent chance likelihood of actually being able to get your successful refund so guys, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.